just to give you a bit of a lay of the land in terms of our elementary schools and types in, in the board, we have uh, 51 single track English uh, elementary schools. Again, these are schools that exclusively offer English programming only. We have 22 uh, dual track schools that offer English and French uh, programming. And these are schools that have uh, grade one or the uh, French immersion programs. We do have seven dual track schools that, uh, that uh, do not have uh, grade one FI, but they are middle schools and offer FI in, in the uh, junior grades up to grade eight. And uh, we currently have six single track French immersion schools, and these are schools that are from grades one to eight uh, in the region. Uh, in terms of Milton, we have in total uh, 16 elementary schools, eight of which are single track English, seven are dual track, and one is uh, dual track that starts later on uh, in terms of grade five or, or six, it's, I believe. So. Uh, that kind of sets the tone of, of what, uh, what is out there. Since 2006, our board has grown in the FI elementary panel by 107% in terms of elementary enrollment in the FI French Immersion Program. Grew from 5,300 students to 11,000 students since 2006. So a total of 5,700 new French immersion students have come into the board. In Milton, the FI enrollment has increased by 285% since 2006, where it grew from 644 students to our current 2,400 or 2,500 students in the program. Almost an 1,840 pupil increase. <clears throat> and again, a lot of the growth in, 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 in the French immersion program in Milton can be attributed to the, the growth in, uh, in the French immersion, uh, the, the number of new schools in, in Milton per se. Just to give you some idea of, uh, sorry, the uh, single track, uh, the single English track uh, schools, the SK to grade one FI uptake are basically the number of, uh, the percentage of students that go from the SK or senior kindergarten program into grade one French immersion. And as you can see in terms of the top line in, in the board, 2006, about 21% came from, of the single track English schools, don't have French immersion, went into the French immersion program in grade one. And it's increased to about 27% uh, this past year. For dual track schools, where they offered English and French immersion, we saw an increase from 51% to 61%, so a 10% increase. But as you can see by this chart, we get a, a, a large percentage of, dual tr of, of students in a dual track school choosing to enter into the French immersion program. We are saving questions to the end of the, the evening, so if you can save your question, then thank you. Region-wide, we've had a, a real range of French immersion uptakes. We've had 0% uptake from a school, uh, the lowest being uh, in Brant Hills in Burlington, to 82% of the SK class at Tom Thompson uh, choosing the French immersion program. In Milton, we've got a more a narrower range. We've got about 40% that uh, the uptake is at Irma Colson and uh, up to 77% of the SK students choosing French immersion, that's at Martin Street. And in that case, as uh, Director uh, Miller had pointed out, we only have three students in the grade one English program at that school for this year. This slide just outlines the number of dual track schools in, uh, with the grade one FI program. Um, as you can see, we have 42% are uh, English students that represent the total amount we have 54% in the FI uh, that are FI students, and we have 4% that are in other programs. But as uh, mentioned earlier by the director, we have in our English program, in those 22 schools, we have about 13 schools that have less than 40% enrolled in the English program. In the French program, we only have four schools. 
Conversely, in the English program, three of the 22 have enrollment more than, than 60% of the total enrollment in SK to, uh, grade one to grade eight are uh, in the English program. And then we have 12 of the 22, almost 50, over 50% 50 of the schools have 60% or more of the enrollment in the, uh, in the French program. So there are some variances and inequities in, uh, in the board at the present time. And in terms of uh, uh, Milton, we have uh, four uh, that have less than 40% of the enrollment in the English program, uh, and two that's less than 40% in the French program, and the converse in, in the 60% enrollment, where we have two that have greater than 60% of the enrollment in the English program, and four in the French program. So as you can see by this slide, we have 51 elementary schools that offer uh, single track English. We have one of those schools that have enrollment less than 15, of, uh, less than 15 students. Dual track with uh, grade one FI, we have 22, of which 12 of those schools have less than 15 students in their grade one English program. Um, and the dual track with, uh, without grade one FI, those are the middle schools that there's no students in grade one. They don't have grade one, so therefore there's, it's zero. Single track French immersion, again, we have zero students. So we have about 13 of our 86 schools where we have less than 15 students in the English, grade one English program. 